Yo, go ahead and excuse me. I just came from landscaping, you know, cutting some grass. Um, just had a quick thought um, that I wanted to share with, you know, kids, parents, and especially coaches, uh, the coaches of these AAU teams. Um, I, I was out this weekend, man, and just I just kind of had a, a, a personal reflection of, of my own personal reflection. And I was just kind of imagining myself in the shoes of a lot of these kids that are out there, you know, I mean, busting their butts, man, um, you know, blood, sweat, and tears, you know, for their teams, for the coaches, and, you know, to achieve, you know, whatever personal goals or team goals that they may have. Um, you know, thinking about myself and the, the the traumatic things that I went through as a child with my with my mother, you know, having mental health issues and, and me wanting to be, you know, me, me needing to have escapes and things of that nature. Um, keep in mind, coaches, you know, for some of these kids, man, this is all they have, you know what I'm saying? Um, a great percentage of them may not go on to play college basketball. They may not get that offer or anything like that. So these memories, you know, traveling around to all these tournaments, man, um, you know, getting, you know, getting sneakers, getting uniforms, you know, eating good on the road, um, meeting celebrities, you know, all that kind of stuff. Um, for some for some of these kids, man, and, and I'm kind of, you know, getting emotional right now, just kind of thinking about it because I'm actually really thinking of myself if, if I was in this position, knowing what I was going through. Um, in middle school and high school for some of these kids, man, this is all they have. You know what I'm saying? When this is over, it's pretty much over, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, the coaches, you're not just a coach, you know, you're a mentor, you're a father figure. Um, some, some kids may be really struggling and going through things at home. So when they're able to go to practice with you guys, when they're able to, you know, go on these road trips, you know, whether it be Peach Jam or out, out to Spooky Nook or just, you know, somewhere in the community at a local tournament and just able to be away from home for a couple hours, for a couple of days or what have you, um, you know, that for those moments, they're able to lose themselves and not focus on the stress at home. Um, you know, parents may be going through whatever, whatever kids' personal situations are. We all have a story. We all have, you know, a situation. Everything's not perfect for everyone. Y'all, y'all understand what I'm saying. Um, but, but just keep in mind, man, you know, I don't want to keep saying the same thing over and over again, but you know, for some kids, this is all they have. And, and these moments are special. So, you know, with that being said, you know, don't rush the weekends, you know, slow it down, you know, allow the kids to, you know, after the game, shake hands, you know, take some photos, you know, relish in the moment, you know what I mean? Um, you know, don't, 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 you know, don't, don't, you know, rush, you know, just, you know, just slow it down, you know, for these kids, you know what I mean? Just slow it down for them, man, you know, allow them to enjoy, allow them to have fun. Um, because the last thing, you know, that, that I would want um, in this situation is that, you know, you do all this AAU and all this traveling and, you know, high school's over and that's pretty much it. Just when the smoke clears, you know, every, all of your memories are just a blur, you know what I'm saying? So you want the kids to, to have some great memories, man. Uh, you want them to be able to build some great relationships. And you know what I mean? Um, you know, let the, let the kids take pictures. Let them have fun. Let them smile. You know, everything's not... I, I get it. You know, it's it's uh, parts of AAU culture that I, that I don't understand, will never understand, um, because I'm just me, you know, playing my role. But I have, you know, some insight as far as how some things goes. But um, I, I know that, you know, you still got to have fun with the game. And, you know, if you're not having fun, what's the point? But some people would say, look, bro, you start, you don't understand. This is business. You know what I mean? It's, it's money involved. We got, you know, we got the sneaker contracts. You know, I, I get all that. And it's, you know, it's, it's, it's big. It's huge. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, AAU hoops across, across the country, it's a big deal. And I totally understand that. But in the same token, you got to have fun. Like I tell my little guys, my little guy memers, you know, he's starting to get his groove on. And pretty soon, you know, all my guys will be, you know, playing AAU, traveling and doing what they do. One thing that I'll never take from them is being a kid. You know, I, I could care less. You know what I mean? They're, they're going to always be kids. They're going to have fun, win or lose, whether they make make a million shots or miss all their shots. You know what I mean? I'm going to give them a hug and smile at them and say, hey, buddy, I'm proud of you. You know what I'm saying? What did you learn? Did you have fun? Most importantly, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, everybody's not like me. Um, I, and I don't want to deviate from my original message, but, you know, for some kids, uh, you know, it's all they have, man. So uh, coaches, you know, keep that in mind. You know, coaches, keep doing what y'all do. Uh, your role is super important. You guys are just, like I said, mentors, father figures. And for some of these kids, you guys are all they have. I mean, in the, in the role of a parent. So, um, you know, um, you know, that's pretty much that, man. Just uh, slow it down for them and, you know, allow them to have fun in the midst of the business and, and, and the seriousness of needing to win and, and all that kind of stuff, man. Um, but I just, I just wanted to share that. 
um, share those personal thoughts, man, because I saw myself in, in, in inside of a lot of these, um, you know, when I looked at a lot of these kids, I saw myself and I was just like, wow, just kind of reflecting on what this would have meant to me at that time, man. It, it would have, it would have meant so much and it would have been a life changing experience and a lifesaver for myself. And I'm sure, um, it means the same thing for somebody else out there, man. So peace, God bless y'all, man. And, um, you know, that's, that's my piece for today.